Welcome back. Treva joins us to talk about an upcoming herb fair. It's actually taking place this Saturday. Mm -hmm. We're talking more than 90 vendors. 90 vendors. I should yes. probably say nearly 100 because they're growing they're rapidly. Still, still today, still more crawling, yes. Well, let's talk about this herb fair. What's it all about? It's all about um, gardening uh -huh. and uh, having people come with their mothers for Mother's Day gifts. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a large variety of herbs that you really can't find any place else. Um, we have like uh, 19 types of basil. Uh, 11 types of thyme, 7 types of rosemary, 12 types, types of mint. Uh, just a lot of hard to find herbs that the Herb Society usually gets in for everybody. And it's just a great day. And each vendor is going to provide an educational opportunity to learn a little bit more about the herb that they're kind of focusing in mm -hmm. on. And um, they're going to have an opportunity for you to purchase some stuff too. Oh yes, yes. A lot of things for the garden. Anything you put out in your yard. Mm -hmm. Um, different types of herbs. We have a lot of vendors who bring things from their yards and uh, dig them up out of their yards and that's always the best type of plant I think to get because it's you know comes right from someone's garden. Well let's so. talk about the herb of the year. It is da 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 da. Dill is Dill. the herb of the year and uh, every year they, they classify an herb of the year and dill is the one this year so we'll be featuring that in the shelter uh, mm -hmm. as an herb of the year. You brought some today. Yes and we'll have um, little things made up like this. Uh, this has got uh, chives in it, uh, rosemary, some thyme. Uh, perfect gift for your mom. And roughly how much would something like this cost? Around ten dollars. Not bad at all. Mm -mm. And they can use it in the cooking process. Now you can use it at home and they can give it to the mom for Mother's Day. We'll have t-shirts and sweatshirts for sale and uh, uh, anything you can think of be outside. This is a great day. Hopefully it won't rain. That's what we're hoping for. I quickly want to get in. There'll be herbal tasting. Yes, yeah, so we'll have an herbal tasting at noon in the gazebo. Um, the members of the Wabash Valley Herb Society, some of the members make up dishes out of our cookbook uh -huh. and we'll have them there for you to taste. And so then you might want to buy our cookbook after you see the good recipes we have in it. And $5,000 in scholarships, that's what you give mm -hmm. out every year. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. Yes, to the local Wabash Valley uh, schools. They all fill out applications and send them in and uh, yeah five thousand dollars is what we give out every year well let's take a look at your personal invitation because folks the big herb fair is taking place this saturday that's may the 8th it's located at fairbanks park from nine in the morning till four in the afternoon it's going to take place rain or shine more than 90 vendors a great opportunity to get that last minute mother's day gift thank you so much treva thank you and we'll be right back stay with us